Hello, Gem. How are you guys doing, y'all? I hope everybody is doing very well. All right, Gems, we're going to jump right into your read to see what's going on with you and your person. Gem, I am using the Everyday Witch deck. So this is, I don't use this deck a lot. I had it, and I think I used it a couple of times when I have it back into the collection. And um, I don't know, I was drawn to it today for some reason. So I just used it on Scorpio's, and I'm going to use it on you now. Okay, so let's see what the angels have for you. If this does resonate, remember to like the video. Give this video a big thumbs up here on the channel. If it doesn't resonate, you guys, I'll have your playlist in the description box. Remember, this is a general, not a personal read. So this won't resonate for everyone, all right? So keep that in mind as well. And also, Geminis, um, go over to the Instagram and support your girl, okay? As soon as we hit the 5K mark, we're going to start those free personal reading on the gram okay live okay so if you're interested copy and paste the link and make sure to click on that and don't type anything else in because don't type it in because there's a lot of scammers okay it's it's coming out of control now they're at work you guys so be very very careful with that all right okay so let's get entwined with your message what's going on for gemini bonus gemini bonus What's going on for Gemini bonus? Thank you, angels. What's going on for Gemini bonus? This cards are in cursive, so I'm I'm gonna have to read it, you guys, and be very careful with it. So I might be a little slow into this. But your first card is the King of Wands in reverse. Okay, someone is not inspired here. I have the push to it's funny this is coming off as someone that is either your twin flame let's see or soulmate not confirmed yet but there's a deep connection here with both of you could be just gemini gemini dating each other here i just feel like a lot of passion you guys are similar okay but you guys are not on the same page at this moment this is what i'm seeing the king of wands the queen of wands in reverse okay you guys are just not seeing eye to eye at this present time one wants one thing the other wants another okay it's like somebody is very generous it's like somebody wants to move forward here but somebody's being very immature about certain things so let's see wow the death okay okay so let me push this over here a little bit Okay, the camera, okay. So, wow, it's like something ended here between you guys, okay? I'm getting very, like a stubborn energy, like a real stubborn energy. Um, this could have blew up really quickly, like uh, I'm getting like zero to 100 really fast, okay? And this ended between you and this person, but there is no kind of moving forward it's like someone is stuck in their energy no one is calling each other texting each other talking to each other trying to break the mold here okay it's like i am not apologizing i am not asking for another chance here but soon enough someone do break in this this knight of cups here it's like pleading for a second chance showing their you know emotions but at the same time there is no direction there is no movement where is this going it's like being stuck like, what can this person give you? Something is off in this connection. I'm getting like this person in the chariot is just not making any moves, but there is someone rushing to someone that doesn't know what they want from this connection, you know? And I'm feeling like it's this person here. It could be an older person, but they're acting really immature, okay? It's like they don't know what they want from this relationship. And I feel like, um, Gemini, this is you being stuck, you know, not moving the way you should. And this, hey, you take it as it resonates because Gemini, this could be in reverse. You could be the problem, okay? <laughs> Don't come for me, y'all. You could be the problem in this connection, Gemini. Oh, I love y'all. Okay. Okay, let's, let's, let's go, okay? 
but I just feel like there is someone that really wants to move forward but are, is waiting, waiting for this person to to call them, to reach out to them. And I feel like someone is just going to do it because this person, it's like, because I feel like Gemini, it might be you reaching out to this person or this person reaching out to you, whoever this is. But I just feel like the person that wants this relationship to work is reaching out and not the person that's stuck in their head because I'm seeing like you're going to have to move alone and find out if what what is right for you and find out if this is what you want and this is the something that you can you know entertain for a long period of time but i feel like you're at a good place i feel like you're not going to be hurt from this i feel like you're just going to you know let them know that you're there for them in the queen of wands if they need anything you know checking on them the showing them some kind of appreciation or showing them some kind of care and affection and love okay so let's see here wow it's like you're willing to fix whatever is going on in the past here see in the star okay so you're really open to that okay ace of pentacles in reverse Wow, there is an end in here. Um, for some of you, it could just be because of the, this person's attitude. It's like you're putting that on hold or some kind of delay with this legacy because I'm seeing like you want a real relationship with this person. For some of you, um, it just could be like, I'm not particularly saying this is a marriage. It could be that's not going too well, but I feel like it's more like, thing, is this a serious relationship, okay? That's just not blossom in the way that it should blossom but i'm feeling like this is from your past with the star being here and you're trying to like change everything or you're willing to work out everything from your past you see faith you see like things could always turn around you feel like the universe is on your side here we have the six of pentacles like there is going to be people coming in to embrace you and help you back on your feet give you something back that you have lost from this ace of eight of ace of pentacles excuse me the time that you have put in with this person okay i'm seeing the temperance here the moon here and also the judgment okay and we're gonna put this back over here I feel like the judgment is very important because something is definitely set in Libra okay we have a few major cards here so let's talk about it the first thing I see is Scorpio vibe so you could be dating a Scorpio okay you're also having um cancer here then we have uh Virgo's energy we have Aquarius energy we have Sag energy we have Pisces energy we have Libra energy a lot of people coming through here as well a lot of people so when that happens, I'm seeing like these are the elements that could um, be associated with your person. But also there's a lot of people having these are people's energy coming into this reading as well. OK, so people that you're dealing with, Gemini. OK, um, it's just a confirmation that you're meant to be here. That's all. But when I call those elements, just those are those are your your per, your person, okay? So it should resonate for some of you, like who this person is at this point. All right, so I just feel like there is going to be some kind of um, appreciation. Like I said, balance is coming back, and I feel like these people are going to help you to get back where you need to be. This could be family, you know, being around you, surrounding you, helping you, feeding you, getting you back. From this situation here trying to let you know like you're not alone but i'm also feeling like in a temperance you guys there is going to be some healing that's going on okay this healing because of reaching out to this person feeling some kind of way of how it ended or this person is not making any moves at all but i'm going to tell you guys something i just feel like this person has someone else okay i'm going to be really honest because for me as a reader when i do see the chariot here it's like they have love for you but they can't that move okay and the death is also here it's like there is no understanding of moving forward it's like what happened okay i still haven't learned the lesson they're not taking it in 
okay? I'm getting like this person is realizing now that there's a mistake as when they lose you because now it's set with the judgment being here. This person did something wrong for this to be here. I'm hearing judgment is being called. This person is going to experience some kind of karmic energy. You understand what I'm seeing? This person, I feel like it's not just you. You're just, you know, another victim with this connection. I feel like they're already with someone else. This is what I'm hearing. This is where I'm, I'm ruling, you guys. It's like two different directions. Which one do you want? And they don't know. Okay. So we have, let's just put this up so you guys can see what I'm seeing here. You have the Six of Wands. You have the Six of Cups. Wow. So this person is from your past. You have the Five of Cups. Oh my gosh. You have the Eight of Wands. The Hyperont. Yeah, this is over and done with. <sighs> my goodness. So the Six of Wands, you know, don't be, don't be afraid. Um, Gemini, you're going to be great. You're going to be, you know, very accomplished and people are going to embrace you and love you and help you. And I feel like you're going to be just like how you want your life to be very, very successful here in the Six of Wands. This is a beautiful card. I also see the love that you have for this person. And like I told you, I don't feel like this person do not love you because the Six of Cups for me as a reader is a strong pull as well with two people being together. They do care about you. They do love you. They are thinking about you all the time. This person is not going to go anywhere. You know, unfortunately, this person wants to have you in their lives, you know, forever if they can. But I just feel like something is holding back this person. Okay. This person often make you feel alone by yourself. Like there is just nothing better out there. You want to be in a real relationship with someone that you can actually share a meal with, have wine with. Look at this wine, two glasses on the table, dinner hasn't been touched here. You are always by yourself. I'm getting for some of you made plans with this person. This person doesn't show up because they can't. They're stuck at home. Okay. They're stuck with someone. They can't get, they can't get to you. I feel like this person wants to, but that gets in the way a lot. We have the age of wands in the reverse this person has so much to tell you i feel like when the first time they saw you they loved you they truly did they fell in love with you they wish they met you first this is what i'm hearing it's like this person is coming off as someone that's already taken for me you know they're going through some kind of toxic separation here um this is a high front it could just include a marriage that is not happening for this person this person is going through it very codependent right now have to be very careful with this ace of pentacles a lot of money is tied up with the situation as well i'm seeing like this person is not apologizing because some of you are coming off as someone that knew like this person was honest about the situation. Why should they apologize? And, you know, if you didn't know, I feel like this person is very selfish the way they're um, holding back on this apology. Again, feeling like they can't, like, I'm just getting like this person doesn't feel like that's something that they need to do, you know? It's like they feel like you deserve better, but at the same time, and say, damn, that's all I think about. <laughs> what are they going to do? Live this way forever? But this is what I see. Gemini, this is your bonus. <sighs> I'm going to leave this here. Um, I feel like we need to take a break. We need to breathe from this reading, right? I love you guys. Know that you deserve so much more. I'm going to say that. All right, you deserve so much more. The angels are with you, guiding you. I did your main today. I did your singles, and this is your bonus. This was rough for me. Um, I love you, and I'll see you guys in your next one. Bye, guys.